Hey guys, uh, this is my first impressions video of the BCM 3D Sigma. This is super quick. I've only had it for a few hours really. Opened it last night, some of you were there in the unboxing with me, had a lot of fun. I don't have enough time with the machine yet to say a whole ton about it. Um, it's just my experience so far with receiving the machine, unboxing it, going through the setup um, and that uh, quick start guide, and then my first print. This video is in English, of course. Um, I do have one in Spanish as well. If you prefer Spanish, check that video out. So if you don't speak Spanish, just ignore that video and watch this one if you speak English. If you speak Chinese, I can't help you yet. We'll get there someday, guys. But in the meantime, my experience has been so crazy positive. Just that whole out-of-box experience with the machine is fantastic. It arrived in one piece in immaculate condition. I was able to unbox the 3D printer, um, set it up, and do my first print in just a few hours. Uh, a few of you were with me uh, with the live streams that I did on Instagram. I'll probably start doing live streams on YouTube too. Last night I was kind of tempted to, but didn't quite have time to figure it out. Uh, but we did about an hour and a half of live streaming on Instagram, and it was pretty awesome. I think you guys will agree it was the setup was easy. Um, the setup itself, like the physical setup, was maybe 20, 30 minutes. And then we got to my first print, which was this Benchy. This is what I chose to print first. It turned out really, really good. Um, especially because their firmware is so awesome and the calibration was so spot on. I was able to get great dual extrusion. You can tell there's no errors with alignment as far as I can tell. Like, it's awesome. I think I need a little bit more retraction probably on the second extruder that's doing the white filament, but other than that, whew, dang. One of my priorities in testing the Sigma is to kind of evaluate their approach to dual extrusion and multi-material printing. So there's not a whole ton I can say right now. The documentation was awesome, beautiful diagrams. Uh, they did such a great job. You can tell this is a company that really cares about user experience. They've invested a lot of time and attention in making sure that the user has a good experience with their machine. I can't speak any more to any other issues I may or may not have in the future. I'll be sure to let you guys know if there's anything I don't like. Um, any feedback that I have will go to um, BCN as well first and I'll be sure to comment on anything um, that's just personal preference because that's kind of what you're subscribing to here right is my personal preference but so far really good experience I'm printing something else right now but I gotta head off to work so we'll see how that turns out but I expect it to be awesome and we'll be digging in a little bit deeper but I've got a lot of other things to work on as well so we're gonna try and balance things out Thank you for everyone who tuned into the live stream and thank you to everyone who's watching my videos here. Uh, keep on making awesome stuff and have a great day. We'll see you later.